is fully experimental. I've got this pad under here that I'm trying for cycling. I'm just gonna stick it in my chick fly pants. This is the fly. And, oops, I think it goes the other way. Let's see. And it's going between the two layers of the chick fly pants. Chick fly has two overlapping panels that open up so that anybody can go pee. Now I've got the cycling pad, it's sticking out the bottom there. That feels pretty good. And this other thing I got in my pocket here, this is a fresh hat. The experiment of today is twofold. Do these chick fly pants work with a pad inside? Or could I make a different model of chick fly pants in the future that's specifically for cycling that um, holds this pad really well? And the positive part about it is that the pad slides in and it's between the two layers of fabric so it's not up against your skin so it's not gonna get dirty and it's also not on the outside so that's the experiment but the other experiment is can i use a pee funnel and go pee with the cycling pad inside through the chick fly so this is that one so oops i put that in backwards too putting everything backwards there got that right now so that's like feels really secure so yeah i already know the funnel works really well because i've used it before but so theoretically i could step off my bike insert the funnel Okay, do it all without being seen. That's a benefit of this combo. Let's put that back in my chick fly pocket there. Super deep pockets down there. Okay. Now we're gonna go for a ride. Okay, here I go. All right, I did have to adjust that slightly. Now it feels pretty good. It's definitely given me some but pleasure, but love. A little extra padding there on this hard seat. So uh, here's where we are.